I'd like to talk to you today about our Orca, our new, newest 57 millimeter weapon that we're develop, in developing right now. As you may know, we currently have a what's called a 3P. It's a pre-programmed, pre-fragmented, precision-timed munition. It's currently in the fleet. Um, it's a very, it's a very formidable weapon system. It's a ballistic weapon. It has multi-modes. It has a radio-free RF seeker on it. It has timed applications and other multi-modes you can mix and match. The beauty of that is it's very effective against surface targets and air targets up to uh, a few kilometers. Okay. When we looked at the uh, upgunning the LCS, we thought you could, well, you could upgun the, gun, the weapon system without changing the gun, without making the gun larger. The gun, the Mark 110, which is in the background here, is a formidable weapon system. It's very reliable, it's very available, and it's easy to maintain. Um, it's, it's the best intermediate caliber weapon system in the world. So when you have the gun, you want to make the gun more effective, what you would do is look at the other elements within the gun weapon system. Fire control, radar sensors, and of course the ammunition. When we looked at the, this ammunition, we said, yeah, that's good, but can we make it better? So what we decided to invest in, and, and we're on a path to, is develop a guided round. Still the same size. When you look at the ammunition that comes out of the 57 millimeter now, it basically looks like this. You got the projectile and you got the propellant. As you fire it, what comes out is this shell. What we're now doing is taking that same configuration but putting a guided, a guided round in there. So what gets fired is this configuration. As it gets fired out of the gun mount, your fins deploy, your canards deploy. Now you are fully controlled um, from the gun to the target. You've already pre-programmed the round as to what target you want to engage. We've already told it we need to go after that particular target. It has the information in its memory. It has a, a seeker in front. And with that information, it'll go out to we, around 10,000 meters and engage your target. Now the beauty is, is that as it goes down range, your effectiveness and your accuracy doesn't change. Whereas the ballistic round, the further you get away, there's wind, there's environmental, plus the targets move. Okay, the one thing about naval engagements is you're moving, your target's moving, everything's in dynamics. So you take that piece out of it by closing the loop between the projectile and your target. So the target is out there, you know what the target looks like, the projectile continues to look for that target. As the target moves, your projectile moves, and you almost have a one-to-one -one weapon to target defeat. So the beauty of that is, multiple things. You can engage more targets faster, because raids are tough. You have to engage the raids, which is not easy to do. You can engage them with one or two rounds instead of maybe 15 or so rounds. Depends on the range. And your magazine has a certain amount of, of, of rounds in it. So as you engage your target sets, you're not depleting your magazine as rapidly for engagement as you would have to with even this great round.